So the first thing to understand when you're doing a barbell box squat is where the bar goes on your back. And this first version I'm showing you is what's known as a high bar position. And the bar sits on top of your trap muscles that are on either side of your neck. It's not really the best thing for our purposes. What you're going to want to do is a low bar position. If you retract your shoulder blades, there will be a groove below the trap muscle and above your, uh, your posterior delt. And that's where we want it. So once you understand where the bar goes on your back, the next thing you're going to want to set up is your box height and figure out how high that needs to be. So the basic way to figure it out is have a seat and you want to have the fold of your hip be below the top of your thigh. If this is too uncomfortable or painful for your knees, set the box higher, no big deal. Still going to get a lot of benefit out of this exercise. So once I've got all of that set up, Unrack the bar, set my feet under my hips, toes pointing slightly out. I'm going to push my hips back, sit all the way to the box gently, and come back up. One of the big mistakes you don't want to make is sitting and rocking back and relaxing, because then I've got a soft trunk holding this weight, and my spine is pinned between the weight and the box, so we don't want that. So you want to sit and stand up. The other big thing you don't want to do is sit down too hard. Because again, you've got your spine pinned between the floor, between the box, which clearly isn't moving, and the weight on your back. So control the descent, sit gently on the box, come up explosively.